you know, we take for granted in the United States having a bank account, being able to uh, send uh, financial ones and zeros uh, over a digital medium, right? You know, over there, uh, I think it's what 70% of people in El Salvador do not have bank accounts. You know, the area I was in, that percentage is far higher. Um, and obviously the smaller, smaller towns and villages. So, you know, a lot of things that we take for granted here in the States, you know, we can swipe a card anywhere, you know, pretty much. Uh, we can purchase things online. We can go to an online store, uh, no problem, and, and, you know, find a good deal and have it shipped to our door, all these things, right? Um, over there, I mean, effectively 70% of, of the people do not have access to that whatsoever. Uh, so think about here, you know, in the States or um, in, in more, the more developed parts of the world, like, that's just what we do. Over there, it's totally different. Um, so, you know, I, I went there um, trying to learn more about these businesses and what their needs are. You know, the, the really interesting thing about businesses there is, you know, like I said, they did not have access to send digital payments. They've been, you know, for, for a decade and a half, a couple decades, completely shut out of, of that side of, of the economy. Right. And so what Lightning has given them the option to do and, and Bitcoin is, you know, be a part of that for the first time ever. But not only that, they're getting to leapfrog all the other countries that, that have access to this and it's abundant, um, completely leapfrog them. Like we have Visa MasterCard. Right. But they're, they're charging, you know, pretty high fees. Um, just to send financial ones and zeros. Like Lightning does it for free or, or increasingly, you know, approaching free, right, is what we, what we think is going to happen. So it's just a huge, huge step in, in the, the right direction for them. Um, they're getting to embrace digital payments for the first time ever. Um, so talking with these small stores and, uh, you know, helping them get set up with their own little online commerce store, right, where they can sell locally. Um, it's, uh, it's really cool to see. And they're really excited about it. You know, you, you can go from, you know, just download the Bitcoin Beach wallet, and you're now accepting digital payments. Like, that's, that's insane. I don't think people uh, quite realize how, how amazing that is for, for a lot of people there.